Hi there, my name is Karen and this is the Changing Caterpillar, which is the fourth challenge in the Khan Academy's Making Web Pages Interactive with jQuery course. So welcome. If this is the first video that you've ever seen, um, stay tuned. There's going to be more videos as I do challenges on Khan Academy. I hope this video helps you. If you've seen videos before, thanks for coming back. And yeah, let's get started. So. Our directions say that we're going to change the heading and it says this web page displays information about the caterpillar. You'll use jQuery to transform this web page into a page about the butterfly instead. In this first step, use the jQuery text method to change the heading to be about butterflies. All right, so let's go ahead and get our dollar sign in there for to summon up jQuery. <laughs> and then we're gonna say what do we want to find it says the we're gonna change the heading um, the heading to uh, which is this tag yep it's an h1 so we put that in parentheses I mean well parentheses and then quotations and then we're gonna go dot text because it says to use the text method uh, and we want to change the text property, so we're going to change it to be about butterflies, the butterfly. Awesome. All right, so that is how we complete the first step. Let's move on to the next step. All right, so this one says change the paragraph. Now use the jQuery HTML method to change the paragraph to be about butterflies. <clears throat> All right. So we want our p tag, so we're going to just put that in uh, parentheses and then quotations, and then we're going to go dot .html because it wants us to use HTML and not text. All right, so let's say the butterfly um, is kind of like a student. <laughs> who works a student of computer programming who works really hard and becomes a stellar programmer. <laughs> All right, so we solved that one. Ta -da! And Hopper has hopped up and said, way to go. So let's move on to the next step. All right, now it says, Use the jQuery atra method to change the image to be of a butterfly using your butterfly image at this um, link. All right, cool. Uh, let's see, how do we do this? So the atra method. So we're going to go, we want to change this image. So we're going to have quotations around image. And then we're going to go dot atra. And then in the second parentheses, we're going to put our, is that how we do it? Um, oh, we want to, we're going to change the source of this image. So we're putting source in this first part of this Atra method. And then in the next part, we are telling it what we want it to change to and we want it to change to this link. Cool, so we have two parts of that, and it looks like I have an extra quotation mark in there. Aha, cool. All right, let's put a semicolon on the end, and Hopper is letting us know that we're doing incredibly well. Yay, let's go on to the next step. All right, this last step, four, four, says change the colors. Finally, use the jQuery CSS method to add some style to the page. Change the color of the heading or butterfly, or what? <laughs> heading or paragraph to match the butterfly. <laughs> All right. Um, <clears throat> All right, so we have, we're going to change, let's change the header one, uh, and let's change its color. So we're going to go dot CSS because that'll let us change its color. And then we're doing the same thing kind of as what we did with this Atra. We're saying first we want to change the color just like we first wanted to change the source. 
color, and then we're saying what we want it to change to. So we're going to say orange. So the header matches the butterfly. Woohoo, we did it. All right, thanks so much for watching. Uh, Hoppers, let us know congratulations. So congratulations to you for completing the challenge, and I'll see you in the next video.